sperren und die ist komplett! Excuse me, Mr. Von Scrooge. Ah! My pen burst. Can you start from the beginning again? Ah, for the benefit of Ronnie Outy Penboy. First, I take this flask of nano nuclear particles. This school trip is bland to the max. Rupert, your dad has the coolest job. Blowing things up, making wormholes in test tubes. Not exactly wormholes. Well, he does have a small hadron collider. Ugh, hadron colliders are so last month. My father's security tech lab has a hadron separator. And look, I mean, only one hamster. It's quite pitiful, really. My father's lab uses hundreds. I can't believe Dad is using hamsters. Yeah, who takes advantage of animals like that? <laughs> I'll get you out of here, little guy. <laughs> oh, oh, Professor! Dennis is holding back scientific progress! I... what? You're safe now, little fella. Small Hadron Collider activation in three, two, one. Are you okay? Uh, I think so. Oh, how did you get in here, you naughty little pet hamster? Pet? I thought you were using him. Oh, how dare you! Who do you think I am, Sir Fasa Volta? And you're sure you're okay, Dennis? Yeah, I'm good. Oh, I wish this was a pie. Olive had loads of sprouts left. I'm just saving these for later. That boy's not okay. Are you sure you feel okay, Dennis? Weird things can happen in Hadron Colliders. Ruby, stop stressing. Oh, anyone notice anything odd around here? Honestly, I'm fine. Here. Ah, uh, uh. Me and JJ against you and Pieface. If you insist, although you know you'll lose. <laughs> oh, yeah? <laughs> 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 It's just that mm. ever since you and the mm. hamster went in the Hadron Collider... Seriously, I'm fine. Hey, pie face. Let me open that for you. Careful, they're pie flavour. <gasps> what? <laughs> That's it. I'm staging a hamstervention. <laughs> huh? At last, you're listening. <laughs> what do you think you're doing, Dennis? I, I don't know what happened. It's like suddenly I knew Walter was going to do something. Like some sort of spidey sense. Or hamster sense. <laughs> hamster sense. That's ridiculous. I've never heard of... <laughs> ah, 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 your, your face! <laughs> Whiskers! <laughs> do you know where hamsters go on holiday? Ooh, no. Where do hamsters go on holiday? Hamsterdam! I'm 
I'm sure if we can somehow reverse the polarity, we could find a cure. <laughs> Why would I want a cure? I've got super patchy cheeks, super norific teeth, super climbing powers and super hamster sense whiskers. I'm basically a superhero. What do you think would happen if I went in the Hadron Collider with a pie? Super pie to the rescue! Uh, oh, I'll need a costume and a cool hamster name. Iron Ham? Mm, ham Solo! Uh, no. Hamster Boy! And a theme song. I need a theme song. I'm going to need a theme song. <laughs> Dennis. Can you keep it down? I'm trying to hibernate here. Yep, I feared as much. <laughs> Guys, I'm fine. Being a super hamster is cool. You're not a super hamster. You're just a giant pet. No. If the Hadron Collider caused this, then theoretically we could reverse the process with a Hadron Separator. Walter's dad has a Hadron Separator in his lab. No problem. Apart from the bit where we have to smuggle a giant hamster into a high security lab. I've hacked into the lab. There is a way in, but it could take days to navigate all these pipes. 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 Bring it on! Walter's dad has built a massive hamster battery! Hadron separators that way. <laughs> what are you doing with Daddy's hamsters? Separator should be right here. Here we go, my furry chum. Initializing separator in three, two, one. Oh, I hope this works. In so much trouble, Dennis. I'm in trouble. I wonder what Beano TV will say when I tell them your dad uses innocent little hamsters to power his lab. <coughs> Not great for his public image. You wouldn't. Oh, I will. Unless you let us and all of those hamsters go. <coughs> Come on, guys. I brought Galahad home. You know what, Stripey Sweater Boy? I think you should keep him. <gasps> yeah! <laughs> After all, 
I now have many, many pet hamsters to look after. The manufacture of stink bomb ingredients on school property is strictly forbidden, so in my role as caretaker, I couldn't possibly comment. What about as Prankmeister General? Now that's a different matter. One more sniff, please, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> 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 mm, good body. Excellent initial bouquet of rotting vegetation mixed with a stupefying pescatorial fondue of vileness. What? It's the full gorilla's armpit! Ah, not quite. It's close, but something's still missing. Ah, it needs... it needs something that smells totally eye-wateringly, nostril-scrapingly... like that! <coughs> What's wrong with you? This is the most expensive hair product ever made! Handcrafted by silent monks from the super rare extract of Scarabaeus Vietae Maximusa. Say what? Dung beetles. Giant ones. <laughs> Whatever it is, it's Pongorama! Shoo! Nasally challenged Philistines! Ha! Maybe that'll smarten you up a bit. Hey, no one messes with the Denny Stew! Wait! Yes. a super stinker. What are you lot up to? Whatever it is, it's bound to be against school rules. <laughs> whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa, what's your name? Nostrils. Whoa! My sensitive whoa. nostril! <laughs> oh! Ah! No! My equipment! All gone! Oh, you've got way bigger problems than that. My father, the mayor, will get you all kicked out of school for this... That includes you! As if! This was almost completely not our fault! The head will totally understand! <laughs> so that went well. Poor Ralph! What's the headmaster saying? Something about... You'll have to go to Posh Street School. You've got 24 hours. What does that mean? Quick! He's coming! Oh. Ralph, old buddy! Oh, dear. What's with Ralph? You heard what the head said. We got him fired. He's only got 24 hours left before he's got to go to Posh Street School. This is awful. This is guff bags. This is quite tasty. I might have seconds. <sighs> We're talking about Ralph getting fired. Oh, yeah, that, that second-hand pants. We're not going to stand for it. Do we sit and watch this happen? I say no. Maybe we can't stop Ralph getting fired, but we can make his last day at Bash Street School the best 24 hours of pranking he's ever had. And I know just how we'll do it. This is what we're going to do for Ralph. Whoa. He'd never be allowed back in Bash Street School again. What does it matter if he's fired anyway? Exactly. Let's give him a day of pranking top top with the biggest prank of all. Nasha, go fetch. <laughs> Boy, come back here with that. Nice moves, Nasha. Hi, Paul. Oh, haven't you lot caused enough trouble for one day? We, we know about Posh Street School and we're really, really sorry. If it weren't for you lot messing about, I wouldn't have to go to Posh Street. I tell you, that place is awful. 
The kids walk in straight lines between classes. No. They speak fluent algebra. No. They don't think whoopee cushions are funny. No. This is really bad. It's all our fault. We're so, so sorry. Okay. That's why we've decided to spend the little time we have left with you doing what you love best. Pranking. Well, I, I suppose I could spare a few minutes over lunch if it's for pranking. You know, I haven't got long, though. Don't say that! Oh. Oh? I'll punch you, Brody. Ah, hard crack at these hands, dog. Thanks, kids. Excellent pranking. I bet they don't get up to shenanigans like that at Post Street School. I can't bear to think about you there. We don't want you to go. Oh, it's too late. So long, prankaloons. You better get back to school. Lunch break's nearly over. Mm, he was a great caretaker. A great prankster. I'm going to miss him so much. We've still got one last great prank to do. Bring on the supreme stinktastic finale! Ready? Ready! <laughs> what do skunks fly around in? I don't know. What do skunks fly around in? Smellycopters! <laughs> Oh, right. Now for the PS de resistance, the Quadro X Fling Thwanger. <sighs> and the all important remote control, because when you set this baby off, you do not want to be anywhere near it. The angle of trajectory allows us a direct shot into the head's office. And with a slight adjustment, we can simultaneously send three more stinkers into the ventilation ducts and pongaroo the whole school. Cool, can I have a go? No! Once you press that button, there's no going back. Ralph is the only one who gets to press it. This could be his last prank ever. Everything's ready. The chosen one who presses this button will be a legend at Bash Street School forever. Oh, really? And why is that? Uh, because it, um, it, it sets off a school-wide domino rally that ends with a giant domino face of whoever presses the button. Ah, well done in ocean. Late as Walter, we've got something important to do. Uh huh, okay. Uh -huh. I'm so good at being bad. Oh, oh there <laughs> you are! Yeah, but not for much longer. I'm all done. We know, and we're sorry. We'll miss you so much. You were the best pranking caretaker we've ever had. The only one, really. All right, all right. It was a fun day. Now get off home. I'll see you all tomorrow. We know we'll never see you again. Not tomorrow, not ever. <laughs> what are you on about? We know all about it. You were fired from Bash Street. And when your 24 hours are up, you have to go and work at Posh Street School. And it's all our fault. <laughs> Back up a minute, pranksters. I'm not going anywhere. Huh? I had 24 hours to get everything ready for sports day tomorrow. And since you lot lost my bag of equipment, I had to borrow a new set from Posh Street School. What? So... You're not leaving Bash Street School. You weren't fired. And you'll be coming into school tomorrow as usual. Nope, nope, and yep. In that order. Amazing! <laughs> Good job we didn't press that red button. Oh, you mean this red button? The one that will make whoever presses it a domino-faced legend? No!
was. I believe. Hey, Walter! Top pranking! In fact, I've got to say, pranks a million! <laughs> 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 Grizzly Gorilla, going on an adventure where I wouldn't last a day without the right survival skills. A nerve-jangling ascent where every step could be my last. I'll be using this carefully researched map, and once I discover the river's source, it'll be known as Grizzly Point. My dad says you're nobody until you've got your name on the map. He should know. There's Wilbur's Square, Wilbur Street, Wilbur's Whiffy Suey Enough Bar already! It's time for Walter Point. I need that map. And cut! Ah, get it off me! Get it off me! Grizzly, it's okay. It's a fluffy mic, not a hammer. Don't say that word! <laughs> <laughs> there he is! The world's most fearless dude! <laughs> fearless? Right. <laughs> Ha, ha, chop, chop, chop! And that's how you survive an encounter with a deadly ferret owl. Hey there. Hey, Grizzly. Need any help on your expedition? Sorry, champ. All I travel with is a flint, a water bottle, and a pen knife. And a film crew. Oh, oh uh, hello. I was just, um... After an autograph, eh? Oh, thanks, Mr. Uh, Driller. Yes, I'm your biggest fan. Uh, Is this a genuine Abyssinian wire-haired tripe? Oh, that's incredible. If you think he's incredible, you should come and see our den. Negative. Sorry, lads. I have to prep a survival strategy for this expedition. But, Grizzly, we, um, need some advice on how to survive in the harsh environments of the woods. One of us could get lost and starve to death! Yeah, you're right. Find yourself in a woodland-based emergency, and my pointers could be a lifeline. Lead the way. Yeah! That huffed-up gorilla wanted to put his name on the map. Well, guess what? He did. Oh, well done, Walter. Now it's our turn. I, I mean, your turn. <laughs> This wilderness is enough to test even the hardiest survivor. And look, that's my grand's house. Grabs up. Proper bush tucker. Nice work, JJ. Grizzly loves these. Uh, yeah. Gram for gram. These grubs are packed with more protein than beef. They're the perfect survival food. Uh, have you got any biscuits? <laughs> that bag looks super heavy, Walter. Then it's a good job you're carrying it. Come on! Oh, oh. Hey, hey, Grizzly, if you thought Nasha was cool, check out Galahad. <laughs> ah, get away from me! What? You're scared of a toy tank? No, not the tank! The ha! The ham! The ha! The ha! They're so close, he does all right us. Huh? The Latin name for hamsters. This way! No, this way! Uh, Ooh. that way. Ooh. Help! Walter! Walter! Hello? 
<laughs> Hamsterphobia. Textbook case. Uh, fluffy cheeks. Lifeless eyes. Like a doll's eyes. We broke a celebrity. Cool! <laughs> Not cool. Grizzly can't go on TV like this. We need to get him over his phobia fast. Love the hamster, you must be the hamster. Go on. <laughs> no escape. <laughs> There's no way this delicate flower's gonna be ready for live telly. Maybe he doesn't have to be ready. Maybe we can use his stunt double. Huh? No one will ever know. Don't forget the mask. Stay calm, Grizzly. I'm a survivor. Wow, it's Grizzly. Sorry, Nasha, you've got to stay here. All Grizzly travels with is a flint, a water bottle and a pen knife. Right? <laughs> OK, OK. A flint, a water bottle, a pen knife and a hamster. Have you got the map? I must have it. I haven't got it, and more importantly, you're not Grizzly. I had no choice. You'll never believe me, but... Someone showed him a hamster? Yeah. I suppose this outfit will have to do. I'm Grizzly Gorilla, and I'm going to show you what it takes to survive against the odds. Watch me live as I do battle with an almost impossible terrain, doing whatever it takes to find the source of the River Beano. Don't overdo it! What do you call a bear with no teeth? I don't know. What do you call a bear with no teeth? A gummy bear. Oh. Gosh, it doesn't look very safe. Uh, ah, see? Perfectly safe. I'd know that spineless scream anywhere. It's Walter. This way. <laughs> Get rid of some dead weight. You're right. Ready? Jump. Oh, I think he means the backpack. Way. That stuff's expensive. <laughs> Grab on. <laughs> Grizzly is out there watching this. And I know he's not going to let his number one fan down. What are we waiting for? Oh, right. Uh, I'm doomed. Uh, Bertie, this may be my last chance to say that... I blame you for everything. 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 Uh, Nasha! This way! I'm Grizzly Gorilla, and I'm going to use every ounce of my survival skills to show these guys how to make it out alive. Watch it! I think Galahad has a plan! <laughs> Do it! Now there's the real Grizzly Gorilla. Bold, fearless. Oh, come on, Grizzly. Galahad just saved our lives. Show him some love. This is going to require me to hold my nerve. Ah. 
So what about the source of the river Beano? You're right. Come on. Hey! What about me? Don't worry, Walter. We'll send you a postcard. <sighs> the source of River Beano. Wow. Careful. One slip and the force of the water could smash you against the rocks. I named this spot Dennis Point. You've earned it. Nice one! <laughs> Thanks, Grizzly. But I think someone else earned it even more. <laughs> ah, Galahad Point, it is! Yeah, yeah. Galahad! Yeah.